What's up guys? Thanks a lot for the visit. The money is here. We are waiting for the disbursement. And unofficially, we have been told that it's this week. The UAG management, the Grand Pressure Group management, all these BB guns have not come out to make a speech. When things go wrong now, they will all come out to do damage control. Now, this is the time the masses need to be told what is going on. Everybody's in the dark. There's a, a limbo period now. There's a lacuna somewhere. You know, everywhere is silent and people are pumping up and a lot of people are feeling anxious and agitated. I believe this is the time the management is supposed to come out and give the masses hope. You know, the aim of this platform, what we are here is to give the masses hope and to tell them the truth. You know, because there is no need of giving somebody hope, building the hope. At the end, it becomes as if you are just putting a bomb under somebody, timing it, waiting to explode. A lot of masses are expecting money. Now, the truth to be told in this video. And um, though some people will go to comment section, I leave the comment open. Why? Because I am not running an NGO. I'm not a bundle head. I don't have anything at stake. Nobody removes my name in any group. If you remove my name in any group, you remove my name in this group, you remove my name in that group, we continue removing. You know, I'm not afraid of being removed from any group and I'm not afraid of being denied my money. So I got nothing to lose. I can speak the truth because what happens in these grand communities is that a lot of people are afraid to say the truth because they have something to lose. Personally, on my own ground, I don't blame them. I don't blame them, you know, because there's a way life will treat you. You treat things with caution. There's a situation which you will be, you will search on what you will say because you have invested it. Okay, let's paint this scenario. You have invested a lot of thing, a lot of money. You have you have taken a lot of pain. You have sacrificed a lot. And if you speak out, you might be removed from the group. You might be removed totally. Then you lose everything. So you just pretend and pretend to be silent, even if you see things are going on, so that you will you will not lose much. You know. So. A lot of people are in the ground community. They don't like what is going on. They can't say anything because they have invested a lot of money, a lot of resources. So they can uh, they don't want to blow it now that the money has come. Because as we stand now, the money has come, it has come, but it's on a speculative ground because they have not officially officially come out and say the money has come. What I'm trying to arrive at, I'm trying to, to, to arrive at the money that the beneficiaries are to expect. Because a lot of people have been communicating me, communicating, calling me and telling me what is the money that the beneficiaries are to be expected. In this video, the thumbnail of this video is good news and bad news. The good news is that the money is there and the money will be disbursed. The time frame is speculative next week, which I can't vouch for it. I can't vouch for it because they have been coming and be giving us hope to the extent that somebody in Kent told them that as you are leaving this Thanksgiving, as you are leaving this arena, before you get home, you will get a lot. So which kind of assurance is, is more concrete than that, you know? So we have been told, our, our sources have been, we have been told and that the disbursement is next week. So, I mean this week, we wait. But the, this video is mostly, is mostly on the amount the beneficiary is going to get. A lot of beneficiaries will be disappointed. I've decided to say the truth because I have nothing to lose. We will be disappointed. So what I said will be disappointed is that uh, the NGOs got beneficiaries and the beneficiaries, this is just what is the truth. 
many people, you know, try to sweep it on the carpet. The beneficiaries were told that the money to be expected is five million. That is the money allegedly to be gotten by the beneficiaries. I don't know about the bundle heads, how much they will get, but the beneficiaries will get five million. Then there is an uh, MOU, there's an undertaking between the beneficiary and the H uh, NGO. Some beneficiaries were told that they will return one million. Some beneficiaries were told that they will return two million. Some beneficiaries were told that they will return half of the money. Some beneficiaries were told that they will be given three million and return half of the money. So those that were asking me how much is the beneficiary going to collect, beneficiary on at the beginning was told five million return half, depending on how you were told by your NGO. Some return one million, some return four million. But the way things are going, the way things are going. This, I'm not quoting anybody. The way I have read the sign of time, I have gotten a lot of information from our sources, and the way things are going, the beneficiaries will be shocked. One, the shockers, the beneficiaries that will receive this money are not going to be much. Secondly, the beneficiaries, yes. So a lot of beneficiaries will be shortchanged, meaning now some NGOs at the beginning were told that every name they drop, they, they will be credited and it is in 1,000, 1,000 bundles. So some NGOs were promised five bundles, which means 5,000, six bundles, 10 bundles, 10,000. Now what happens in the case now, which is the scenario now, a lot of NGOs bundles have been slashed down. Those that were expecting 10 bundles are having, let's say, one bundle. So which means somebody that submitted 1,000, 10,000 names ends up having 1,000 slots. So what do you expect? He choose his favorite those that are important to him according to proof of reference and this goes to them. Meaning only 1,000 gods out of 10,000. That is one scenario. Then the second one is now those 1,000 that are getting, I bet you that money is not up to 5 million. Remember, there was a time there was general speculation that beneficiaries are receiving 100,000. That was coming from somewhere. And remember, there was a time too they said beneficiaries 50,000. That is coming from somewhere. That is two. Then the third one is remember bundle heads. Bundle heads were shouting. They have sacrificed a lot and they are being short changed. Now, bundle heads are going to be fixed as beneficiaries. As in, some beneficiaries name will be removed then there will be a multiplicity of bundle heads so bundle heads money will be compensated with some beneficiaries money making the beneficiaries to be reduced so which means fellow beneficiaries a lot of beneficiaries will be slashed down and the money for the beneficiaries may not be as we were expecting this is a sad truth this is an unfortunate truth so those benefit those uh, we beneficiaries are raising our hopes that if this money come we'll buy land build house i pray we'll not be disappointed because if you get the money if you are opportune to get the money the take home may not be as your take home you were thinking that you are taking home so guys i'm sending this message some people will discard it you know but those that have been in this grand committee for eight years will see the reason for what i'm saying because for eight years they have been waiting so which means in this grand community anything is possible so guys see you on our next update guys ike.com is out peace out one love remain calm remain safe let's pray to god that all things work out fine bye for now